The young man beside me, along with his colleagues, is behind the most amazing innovation in Uganda. My name is Dominika Toa, a founder in Ebenezer Energy Saving Stocks Limited, which started in 2018. The government came up and banned charcoal burning in the country because it's been encroaching on forest cover. The story behind Ebenezer Energy Saving Stocks came as an idea, for I was inspired by a plight of women from more far distances, mostly in villages to collect firewood. Current nominations head to Ebenezer Energy Solutions where I will encounter a group of young Ugandans who are making a significant impact with their innovative energy saving stoves. At Ebenezer Energy Saving Stoves Limited, building a greener future one stove at a, at a time. These stoves are more than just tools for cooking. They represent a transformation in livelihoods. Once you add charcoal, it takes time for the stove to get ready. But this one, you just switch on and then start straight away. According to a report by the World Health Organization, exposure to household air pollution contributes to non-communicable diseases such as stroke, heart disease, chronic pulmonary disease, and lung cancer. Our stoves are designed in a way that you don't need to be at risk that when take the stoves, they will produce all air destroying the environment. Despite this alarming reality, over 2.3 billion people worldwide still rely on sold fuels for cooking, as many lack access to cleaner alternatives. So you mean this is a sustainable it solution? Is, yes, it is a sustainable solution. Join me as we delve into the inspiring journey of Ebenezer Energy Solutions and explore the transformative power of sustainable technology. So right where I am, it's their showroom, the main main branch where they make these stuff from it's in Chengera. I'll go there tomorrow and check it out. Let me see if these guys uh, have something. Oh, so what are we looking at here? Uh, here we are looking at an Ebenezer energy saving store okay. that is ready for use and it has a dimmer switch oh, yeah. which you use to either increase or decrease the, the heat. Okay. So when you're cooking it is up to you to increase or, or decrease, decrease depending on whatever you're going to cook. Just like you can see it has a battery that yeah. supports the fan system. This stove has an inbuilt fan system. It comes with an inbuilt fan system. The fan system powers the powers the fire within the stove. Okay. Remember it uses stones, which stones cannot work magically without a power source. Yeah, so, someone will even wonder how yeah, can a rock... How, yeah, I know, I understand. <laughs> it is quite hard to convince a person yeah. that a rock can cook, but here we are with the solution. So now you have you have put switch on the fan. Yes, I, I have. Can see the fire is can see the fire increasing. It is you, the chef or the person in the kitchen, who determines the speed at which, the rate at which you cook. Hello. Hi. How are you? Fine, thank you. You're most welcome. Wow. This is our facility where we fabricate our stoves. This is where everything is done. Yeah. After making them from here, we transfer them to the showroom or the office where inquiries are made. So all this is our stuff. You can come as well and take a look. Guys, I'm excited to learn more about these stoves. I'm quite mesmerized. So let's go and find out what's happening inside here. Mostly at our office here. Okay. We look more at the safety of our clients, our okay. customers, okay. our guests and our staff. So on that issue, I'll provide you with the safety safeties we use for now. Okay. I can give you the shades um, for your eyes. Okay. I'll give you a reflector also, so that you become part of the staff. As you can see, everyone around is branded with our company logo color, and everything. Right? Okay. Yeah. Um, you have to look uniform. Of course, when you just arrive into the facility, what welcomes you are these rocks and the sitters or the bases of these stores. I was told that they partner with um, a certain company which makes these uh, bases. In our company we have like five departments, so today here in our facility where we have the fabricators who do the metal fabrication. I'll take you to the senior technician, senior fabricator 
It's called Musa. Uh, we will take you through our store, how it is made. It's quite amazing seeing how these young men are mentored into a very valuable people. They spend time in this facility fabricating these stoves and they do it with so much love. Most of them actually they are trained from the facility while others like Musa they have prior knowledge about welding or fabrication. As you can see there is a lot of things going on in this workshop. It's not just the stoves. Okay everything is, is to do with cooking but we have different gadgets as you can see. Okay. Uh, besides the solar stoves there is a grill here. There are ovens there and there are other things they are working on. I can't mention them all and we can't see them all today. What these guys are doing is to, make, to ease the work of cooking by providing clean cooking materials uh, that are first of all economical, they will save you money, they are healthy, they are safe. This is what um, is happening around this humble facility. When you take this stuff, you are not only supporting us, but you are supporting the government or the whole country as large. As you know that cutting off trees now is almost illegal in Uganda and all parts of East Africa. As we come or as years come, there will be no more cutting of trees. When you embrace this technology, it will be somehow saving or conserving the environment as we prepare the, our country to a greener, greener, greener future. We arrived at a bad hour, it was lunch hour. The kids were having their lunch, couldn't fill in, we didn't plan so well, and also the principal wasn't able to speak to us. However, we spoke to one cook in the kitchen and he testified that really the stoves are doing an amazing job. Before, their kitchen used to be so smoky and it could really cause them some health problems, but ever since they started using these stoves, at least that problem has been solved. Also, the stoves are cost effective and they're also very fast. Their heat turnover is very long. It means they can cook in the morning and by lunchtime the food is still hot. Even when they are switched off, it can take them about one to two hours to completely cool down. I believe that for us mothers who prepare matoke and love it so much, yeah, this is the perfect stove well. for us. Yeah. Us who like simmering gina because they are supposed to be cooked on low heat, exactly. this is the perfect option for us. I took a course on environment conservation I had an idea of innovating something that could cook fast smarter and cleaner and more saving with our dream so far we have managed to distribute our stocks to more than 100 million people we are going for our goal of 2030 where we want 1 million households in Uganda on top of that we've managed to acquire a piece of land somewhere where we want to set up a bigger factory as you've seen here our facility is a bit small we want to scale up fabrication employees oh, we have okay. different employees mm. we have the sales people okay. uh, we have the construction employees okay. so where we are they are only fabricated so most of them are outside of the field okay. they are busy they are okay. doing their job okay. and uh, what we do mm. as a company mm. i personally when i bring these people to work here i personally train them because you can't find someone who's working the door outside doing the same thing as the one like the one we do here okay. so they need more training so they get job training I guess they get. so there is uh, what we are having here is this is where they get the mud from this mud they mold um, the insides of this stuff what's the next step Putting in these liners. Okay. Oh, we do How long have you been working here? Almost five years. And so how do you find your job? The job is good and free, and I do quite. Something interesting, these people at the facility, they have a motto that Building a greener future, one stop at a time. It means they have lots of orders. The supply is not matching with the demand of the stores. That means there is need for more. But despite that, they don't work on the pressure. They have to produce one perfect stove at it. Ego, it means they are committed to 
quality, the more I interacted with people at the facility, the more curious I really wanted to find out about the users. We have the producers this time. How about the consumers, their clients? What are they saying about the stores? Before I used to have the other small store, and then I came to Ebenezer, I was told how, the, how their stores, they do work. They're so effective, they're very fast. So wait, where song. did you hear it from? So my neighbor, I have oh, my neighbor, okay. so he told me that it's very good, it's very fast, so I can sell and it can help my, my business to grow. So I tried it, I had my seven, I tried it, I went, I inquired from them, so they told me how it works. I was like interested, so I had money, I talked to my husband, I had money, we went, but and then we bought the store. So we used it and it's so helpful, it has helped us, it has, we've saved at least and I managed to get a second business oh, really? because I'm not like using too much money like before I can sell I can work on many customers as possible of which it was it wasn't like before it also creates a green environment like that it does not small not giving out too much heat like that so I had an appointment with Rahim Foods that's a restaurant which is very famous for serving Islamic food as before that it's never go for now you know actually like to uh, to struggle Actually, we get the time. Maybe since we, we get we got the things, so it made a collection. It gives us a couple of good things. At least saving, saving a man that like. You cannot only imagine how how much beneficial it is, how much good it is, but also how much cost effective it is for you and your family. Save the environment, save the cost, minimize the way you spend on charcoal, on gas, or any other means that you're using for cooking. Thank you.